customer buys, I know I do, especially when you get something on sale. But then you think, how can I elevate this? How yes. can I take this to the next level? And sometimes it just takes a really easy hack to get it done. So Janice, you have picked a few key items and made them next level. I hope so. Oh, I think so. I think so. This is my favorite stuff to do. So I found this skirt and it was $22. Tool, it has a liner, pretty common. We had lots of pleated tool skirts. Yeah. So what I'm gonna do is cut out the liner because that just makes it a little too matronly. And we're gonna get rid of that. And then what I have found is that, you know, now we're at a certain age, there are things that we just can't wear and we want to wear because they're too short. Right. This is the perfect thing to be using your tool skirt for. So look how cute this skirt is, but it's short. And especially if you're working, you could not sit down in this skirt. <laughs> you could not sit down with people around you. Right. So what we're gonna do, I happen to love this color combination, but easily enough, you can get some dye. It is less than $5. Yes. And what you wanna make sure, when you're purchasing your things. Your tool is gonna oh, be light, cute. take the liner out. And actually, you know what? You could wear the line, the tool skirt without the liner with like a mini skirt going out at night. Can we show okay, them? Okay, well, tell <laughs> what that looks like. I know that you probably yes. want to sew it or something. Yeah. Yes, I but do. But look at the look already. I mean, that is a gorgeous. We'd want to have a little bit of the detail at the front. Make sure the tool comes mm. out at the top, so you're paying attention to that. The cut of the skirt has to be wider, again, we talked about it, than underneath. Don't yes. get something tight. But think you could do this with lace. If you have something that's got a button down the pencil skirt and it's a little too tight, undo the buttons and have mm. some tool peeking out. So many options that you can do with that. I love that. Yes. That is great. Okay. Okay, moving right along to yes. a new uh, fashion trend. Well, it's an old fashion trend, yeah. but it is back like everything else. That whole Peter Pan collar, tons of people are doing it. Yes. And so this is a dickie. Okay, so it's the, I remember when I was a baton twirler, we had little dickies as part of our uniforms. Yes. And I love them. So now they're back, but they don't look the same as when I was a baton twirler. No, I a little yes, different. a little bit different. So I actually picked up this shirt in the boys section at Old Navy on clearance because it was damaged. Yeah. And so uh, wash it, press it, and then I'm just cutting, I've cut out the shape already, okay. except for across the bottom. Again, it's okay. We just need it to go around our neck. So we don't care if it by chance happens to be like cutting through on many layers, yeah. Like it doesn't matter if it's a little bit um, well, we rugged? Well, we only want the collar, right? So we don't, a kid's one is fine. Okay. So again, this we're done with. It was damaged already. So now we're left with our collar. Um, and what we're gonna do is, I've bought some jewelry pieces. I've, these are actually shoe clips. Oh, they are? Yeah, they're the, the, the designer jewelry. Yes. And it actually works. And Those this are is earrings. an earring. So Oops. what I'm gonna do is actually, I'm gonna open this up and take the the earring part off so you just easily the enough. Okay, close your eyes. I'm gonna cut this little hook part off. Okay. Easy to do. So you're basically making a brooch, aren't you? I'm making just a, an ornament, yes. not even a brooch. Okay. And then what we're gonna do, we're just gonna play around. So I kind of liked that there. I'm gonna take the end, the earring part off. Again, just clip these pieces just off. show you how yeah. that looks. So this is going to be the final look when it's on. Ooh, Come ooh, on far. hello. <laughs> There you go. And then, so there's the top of the earring. Yeah. I'm gonna put that down. And then I'm gonna like glue down at this, I think. So you're gonna make your own embellishments. You're gonna put yep. them around the collar. You're basically gonna glue them. And here's the And when it's pieces. all glued, you clamp them. So, and you want it to dry, because these are bumpy on the back, so we need some substantial glue on it. Yeah. And then there we have the end. These are You can wear this with a sweater without adding any more bulk. Think about it that oh, way. That's true. Do up a ton because then you can do like you could turtleneck. You could also do this to the toque of your hat. Put oh, some yeah. jewels on it. Just make sure there's something underneath. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if you wanna. You don't really get full coverage. From no. This, but the whole point is to give you a little collar action. Yeah, and that's why that's from cute. your simple black sweater that you've had for ten years that you spent a lot of money on cashmere. Yes. This is the way to judge it up. Top. Yes. Okay. Finally, I love the attention to sleeves yes. uh, this season okay. and last season so it's still happening now you've taken this beautiful coat simple opera coat it was $40 could be vintage you could yes. have got it at a second hand shop you know me I'm always super conscious of the length of the sleeve yeah. so I've shortened the sleeve we want it just like a little bit below your elbow or okay. you could even do like bracelet but yeah. we want a little like elegant and delicate and a little bit again interest if you want to have something long and underneath yes. it that's what we're gonna do nice now what we're gonna do as well is I have this feather 
Um, it's on a ribbon. You can order it online. I got it at a sewing store. Oh, nice. Easy peasy. And what I've done is I've actually glued on a simple package of snaps. Uh -huh. I've glued and sewn on snaps. So I think that is the best idea. Um, and I course you're did it not, in black. <laughs> yeah, you don't, you're not gluing, you're not sewing. Yes. You're just putting on these snaps. And then, because then what you're going to do is you can snap it in right here. Go ahead. There we go. And this is giving you instant sleeve pizzazz. And instant hem pizzazz. So there oh, is your Oh, the hem. So this is the bottom of it. And think yes. about all of the ways that you could use this. You could do this on the bottom of a jean skirt. Yeah. You can do this on the bottom of pants if you want that look, right? This is totally Prada this season. Yeah. Down the front of your coat, off the back. But do it, like, because we did it with snaps, you can take it off when you wash it. Right. And then you can do it anywhere. Just keep on buying snaps. These are a couple bucks. What a great idea because, yeah, these are a little delicate. You're not going to want to throw them in the washing machine. Great hacks. Yeah, so and much thank you fun. for extending our wardrobes. Let's go to break. We have more coming.